Hello everybody and welcome to Pokemon Godra version, which is a fan game. It's a PC game. I don't know what this game is all about. I just know that I don't have the proper fonts and salts and I frankly don't give a crap. You might be able to hear my keyboard since I can't play this with my controller. I'm just going to start a new game. I don't know what this game is all about. I don't know if I'm going to finish this game. I know that I'm probably not going to be doing a Nuzlocke challenge on it. I know that the game is a bit... Well, I don't want to say glitchy, but with like transitions and stuff, the game is a bit iffy. These are the controls. Uh, you use the arrow keys to move, the C key as the A button pretty much, the X key to exit, uh, cancel a choice or mode, or open the pause menu, and then the Z button to run. So there's a different button for that, which seems a bit strange, and then your register item is at F5, which seems really awkward to me. Uh, so I don't need to advise again, thank you very much. I don't care about adventure. Let's just go no info needed. Let's start. This world is inhabited by creatures called Pokemon. It's the same dialogue you always get. Bear in mind, this is not a ROM hack. If I hadn't made that clear yet, this is a fan game. It's not a ROM hack. It's built from the ground up. In a certain engine, Probably because I do recognize the icon. I, I do recognize the icon from somewhere. I just don't quite remember what. It's not a RPG maker game, I don't think. Could be though. I don't think it is. But I do recognize the icon. What are we talking about? I'm vlogger, thank you. So you're vlogger. Uh, yeah, I, I pressed the wrong button. Last question, where you, were you born? West or East? This probably influences the game to some extent. I just don't know how. So I'm gonna go with West. I don't know if I'm going to cut these up with episodes afterwards or during the record. Probably afterwards. Uh, during the recordings. I don't, I don't care to be honest. Oh, hello there, vlog. Also, new style of layout. Uh, it's different from the kind of layout I usually do. Then again, so is the Pokemon Platinum one. It's, uh, this this one I like. I like the Pokemon Platinum one better in a way. But Pokemon Platinum is over now, so... Oh, hello there, vlogger. I thought I'd find you here. Today's a big day, you know? Aren't you excited? I'm pretty sure you know this already, but I have to give you the speech. Because that's what the game tells me to do. I like this music. Regulation and all. You know, um... How the Elite Four would look at that. Stuff, things, trainer, and Ray, the Pokemon professor, helped start your adventure before we head to the lab for your questions. First of all, do you remember? I, I did actually not remember to fill out the registration. I honestly don't know what registration he's talking about to begin with. Of course you did. I have to. We, well, that. Um. That seems like a counterproductive thing. So, what are these choices about? Because they don't seem to affect the dialogue whatsoever. I didn't want to <laughs> pick fire there. Uh, I'm certainly not going to go with fire fighting. I'm going to just go with water. Uh, just two more lists remaining. Let's go with poison here. And... Ghost for sure. Still Ghost, uh, it was a tough question, but I feel like Ghost wins that just by a little bit. Might want to make a list on that, to be honest. I can I run already? I can run already. The game looks fairly nice. The music is very good. It seems like they use Pokemon Fire Red and Leaf Green style graphics. I might actually want to play this on a higher resolution. Next time right eye. Let me go into the options menu. Can you go into the options menu? Uh, options. There's the font style and menu frames and speech frames and tech speed on fast please, battle scenes. All that kind of good stuff. And then the screen size small, medium, large. The way I'm playing now is medium and I had to upscale quite a bit. But large doesn't quite fit on my screen. Yeah, kind of sucks a bit. So... That's the way it's going to be for now, meaning that it's probably going to be a slight amount of blur going on here. Nothing much I can do about that. Cloud Veil. 
looks an awful lot like Pallet Town to me. What? There's four stars? Wait, 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 wait a second. There is four starters. The first one being a Growlithe. Uh, Mo, thank you very much. Second one being a Krabby. Third one? Is it going to be the third type I choose? What is the third type I choose? I think it's poison. Oh, so that's how you get to pick your starters. All right. Akins or Dusk. Gonna go with Dusk. Yeah, Dusk. And of course, I'm going to nickname everybody still. Oh, you can type nicknames! I love this game! I fucking love this game! Okay, you're going to be called... I'm not gonna... Am I gonna go with a nickname theme? I'm not gonna go with a nickname theme. I'm just gonna name people. Pokemon, I'm very sorry. And you are going to be named... You know what? I don't have a good name for Duskull. I really should. I've thought about this, but I didn't... This is completely blind. Just in case you didn't know this, this is completely blind. I don't know what's going to happen. I don't know what is actually happening as we speak. So everything just is coming to me as we experience this together. And that means that I'm not really in a position where I can think about this ahead of time. So I'm trying to buy time, trying to explain this to you guys while thinking about a name. And I'm going to go with... Luigi, because Luigi's mentions and ghosts, which means that I'm going to call you... I don't want to call you Boo, but I don't want to call you Luigi, just... If I want to call something Luigi, it's going to have to be a nose pass, and just in case I find a nose pass, I don't want to call you Luigi. However, I am going to call you Luigi. I hope that's how you spell Luigi, otherwise I look really dumb right now. Uh, it's really awkward because I'm used to emulator controls. And now the controls are different from how they would be on an emulator. So it's really a bit annoying. That being said, it doesn't matter too much to me because I'll get used to it. The most annoying thing here is the fact that I just can't use my controller. Also, I'm recording this at night. Can you tell? Is this my house? Vlogger's home? I figured it would be. And this is Ashley's home. I didn't get to name my rival, by the way. Route 1. This is not a Nuzlocke, so it doesn't matter what I encounter here. I can spend as long as I really feel like just trying to grind up for a decent encounter here. And listen to this music, dude. Just fucking listen to it. I like this game so far. Our first encounter is a Rattata and... We literally cannot hit Rattata. <laughs> oh, this is gonna be horrible. There's gotta be something in here which is not a normal type. Otherwise, we are screwed. We cannot hit normal types at all. Oh shit, that's not good. That's really bad. <laughs> Potentially. Well, I thought he was actually blocking me uh, as part of a event. But he isn't. So nobody's battling me yet. Which seems a bit odd. You know, with this music actually feels more like an RPG than a normal Pokemon music. The more, normal Pokemon music is like happy, of uplifts, happy game music. But this actually feels like it's a theme which would play in an RPG town, which I can appreciate that because I mean, if you hadn't noticed so far, I'm a huge fan of RPGs. Also, why did I take my hands off the keyboard there? Lake Omol. Uh, how about we find a Pokemon first and buy me some balls to catch things? I think that would be useful. Uh, this looks like it might be a Pokemon. But they did keep the Pokemon music. Um, wait a second. I, I walked out on that by accident. It's not like the game actually forced me to. Yeah, I'm not going to be allowed in there, am I? Sorry, we're busy. I just... 
And it really annoys me that I don't know what engine this is on, because I know it's on a pre-existing engine, uh, game-creating thing. Oh, I can actually just go in here, wow. And I don't know which one- oh! Random encounters in here, I did not expect that. Hey! It's Burger! Burger! Oh, uh, do I have any balls? Please tell me I have got balls. I don't have any balls! Oh god, I don't want to kill Burger. As a matter of fact, like this, I'm not going to be able to kill Burger. But I need experience, man. I need another move to hit something that's, you know, normal type. I can't hit normal types. But I would like to catch Burger. It hurt its having confusion. Of course it did. I'm rushing through these menus quicker than the menus can actually pop up, which is not all that great. But you can't hit me, which is really good. Because I'm gonna come back in here as soon as I possibly can, and I'm gonna catch this burger. Also, I don't know if there's a possibility we can get Bob in this let's play, but if there is, we're getting Bob. Because this time, there's no first encounter rule bullshit, we're getting Bob if we can. And we're getting burger. I mean, I know I can get burger, so I'm fucking getting burger. Please do not hit yourself this time. Thank you for actually killing the Magnemite. That was more difficult than I would have expected from something that cannot actually hit me. Oh god, it's not a battle. It's a Pikachu! I'm gonna run the fuck away from... Pikachu's probably gonna kill me. Yeah, Pikachu is surely going to kill me. Also, you can easily swap out um, textures and sprites in this game. So, if there's a certain thing I want to do, like uh, switch out burger sprite for something which actually looks like a hamburger, uh, mixed with Magnemite, do, do some sprite editing. I've done sprite editing, editing, wow, talking, it's hard, isn't it? I've done some sprite editing in the past, so... Alright, so I should be able to maybe do that. I can sw uh, swap out some sprites from some Pokemon and have a good time with that, generally. And that killed Luigi. It's a good thing this is not a Nuzlocke, is it? Oh, there's an item here. Once doesn't like... I wanted my Lotic, that's my fucking my Lotic from now on out. You understand? Mom, you're sleeping in the kitchen, so I want to strike. I want to strike a deal with you. What about? I get your melodic. You can move up into my bedroom. You can sleep in my bed. I'm gonna go on an adventure anyway. I'm not gonna use it, but I require your melodic for this to work. Just think about it. I'll return. I will return. But I want a melodic. Also. Does my rival sister still give me the town map? She's still here. She certainly does. So now let's go back to that little town and see if we can actually get any... I don't know. Pokeballs to catch things because I want to catch Burger. Also, I still like the music. I would tell you though, another thing I cannot hit because it's a normal type. Let's get that. Luigi, you're slow as fuck. Oh, I can't escape from anything. I also can't hit anything, so that doesn't help either. Now, please, for the love of God, I am serious right now. Run away. Thank you. I still don't like the fact that there's a separate sprint button, which I should like that, by all accounts. That should be really great. That should be something revolutionary for the Pokemon franchise, but it's just kind of not. It's just kind of annoying me because I'm not used to it. Well, here's a Pokemon Santa. Are the shops in the Santa? No. But there's a Misty here. Right, you look like Misty. I... I don't... 
There's a gym here as well. I want to find a Pokemon Mart to buy some balls. That's all I want in life. Well, actually, I want to be the very best. Like, no one... This looks like a bicycle shop. No, it's a... You know what? Let's end of this episode. This has been the first episode of Pokemon Gold Rider Edition, and so far, I like it. I really do. Until the next time, do not forget to leave a like and subscribe to my channel if you have enjoyed this video, which hopefully you have. You can leave a like and subscribe, like I said. You can also share me on social media and follow me on my social media down below. That was not the way I usually say that. Until the next time, I have a vlogger. You have been awesome as always. Bye.